Hello everybody, welcome and welcome back to the channel. My name is Beachy Bunny and how is everybody doing today? Well, I am in Orlando for a uh, convention and I'm like, there's gotta be some hot pot around here. There's got to be. There's so many options, so many great reviews. So I am going to just go on my phone pick the closest one to my hotel, and I'm gonna show you which hot pot I pick. I am so excited. Um, I have been here all weekend. Tomorrow is my last day, and I was like, look, I got to get out of this bed and check out a hot pot while I'm in Orlando, because I usually don't come to Orlando like at all. So come along with me, and I'm gonna show you which uh, hot pot I choose. See you there. All right, we have made it and it is called the 818 Hot Pot. So we're about to go in here and see what this is all about. in my um broth but yeah it's really cute in here it's not packed so we're gonna go see what everything looks like you got your standard you got all your mushrooms quail egg um chicken eggs seaweed um um everything lobster balls you got your lobster balls dumplings shrimp paste you got your mussels scallops oh they got frog legs they got um, all kinds of octopus, squid, scallops, baby clams, shrimp, and crab legs. Oh, I thought I cut it off, but over here you got the noodles, and you got the mushrooms, you got your veggies, bok choy, all that stuff. You got your um, fruits, you got your desserts, your seaweed salad, kimchi. You got some more things over there. This is for the barbecue area. And this is your sauces. So yeah, they got a lot of stuff. All right, I am back at the table and I'm gonna show you what I got. So of course I got my broth right here, the Szechuan pepper sauce. Got the mushrooms, bok choy. You got some noodles, some um, seaweed salad. I got lamb, pork, and beef. I got some seaweed, oh, I'm sorry, some seafood. I got some mussels, I got crab, um, cuttlefish, I got um, crawfish, shrimp paste. I got black fungi, shrimp with the head on, and then I made my sauce. Now we are about to eat, and I will let you know how everything goes. All right, let's see how these noodles are. I mean, not noodles, oh my goodness, seaweed. You see how hungry I am. Really, really good. They have some funky noodles. I don't know what, I know they're glass noodles and vermicelli, but I have no idea what these thick noodles are. But I'm gonna try them, so we're gonna go ahead and put them in. bok choy and my um, mushrooms in there. I got oyster mushroom, enoki, and seaweed. I don't know why I keep saying seaweed, but seafood mushrooms. Mm. I 
just made a boo boo. chill in here like there's like nobody in here so I picked the best one so I am happy that it's not packed and I can like vlog in peace so yeah I'll be back once this starts cooking all right so the meat is done let me get a video so the meat is done all the veggies is done I am so sorry I just smoked up my <laughs> Hold on, let me clear it out for y'all. Okay, so let's get this. I'm just gonna put it in a plate. All right, it's really hot. I got beef, pork, and lamb. And I can't wait to try it in my dipping sauce. And I got some bok choy. Hey, I gotta be healthy a little bit. All right, so this is what it's looking like. Oh, gotta get some of the noodles. So I'm gonna try it. I'm gonna try it with my dipping sauce right here. All right, let's see how this is. Don't make fun of me. That dipping sauce is so good. I learned a little bit from my other last hot pot experience. I watched the lady, cause she's like, oh, do you want me to make you a sauce? And I was like, yeah, yeah, yeah. And she made me a sauce and she told me what to put it in there. And I was so excited. Yes. I'm just putting some more broth in here. Thank you. Um, but I put chili oil. I was so afraid of chili oil. I thought it was gonna be so overpowering. But that chili oil hits. So I put garlic, chili oil, cilantro, um, some kind of um, bulgogi sauce, um, um, green onions, um, garlic soy sauce. I was so happy to have garlic soy sauce, but it was super duper good. But this is really, really good, you guys. Like, as you can tell from my videos, I'm very obsessed with hot pot. I have devoured the meat and I just put in the um, the black fungi and the seaweed. So I'm gonna show you. I'm sorry. <laughs> so this is what the black fungi looks like right there. And then the seaweed knots. Um, I did put in some, um, some calamari, some mussels, mushrooms. Um, I did put in an octopus somewhere. Oh, there he is. And then there's the octopus. So I'm just gonna wait for this to cook and I will be right back. I've never been to a hot pot restaurant where they have calamari, calamari rings. So we're gonna try the calamari with my dipping sauce. It is super hot. Ooh. It looks like a Funyun, but a rubbery Funyun. Mm. They also have a seaweed braid. That's just nothing but seaweed. <laughs> I'm gonna dip it in the, um, in the sauce too. I am burning my mouth for you guys. Like straight up burning my mouth. Mm. It's really good. I'm trying to find an octopus for you guys, but I don't know where my octopus is. 
I don't know how many I grabbed. I may have grabbed just one, but uh. I'm sorry, I'm trying. Do y'all have problems grabbing stuff with chopsticks? Because I am. I am having the worst time tonight. Okay, so here is a black fungi. It's just like mushrooms, it's just called black fungi. Very, very good. <clears throat> this sauce is spicy because of that bagogi and I put chili oil in it. Ooh, I found me a piece of beef. Mm. It is so good. I mean, everything is flavored wonderfully. All right, we are getting down to the wire. I just cooked my big uh, shrimp that has the head on. And uh, the pot is starting to get very empty. I got one crawfish left and some seaweed and some um, mushrooms. And then I am working on a little bowl right here. I may go get some, um, I may go get some more beef because I like the beef. I didn't get a lot of beef because, you know, you don't want to be rude. It's starting to fill up in here. It's Saturday night. You don't want to take everything. So I may go get some beef and try out some dessert. So we shall see, but everything is really good. <clears throat> they got a 4.5 rating on Yelp and on Google. So it's really good. Everything is good, um, you know, seasoned well. The things that are seasoned, everything is pretty much fresh. Um, they did have crab legs. I have not got the crab legs. I may try some crab legs, um, but they don't have butter. And how can you eat crab legs without butter? So we'll see. All right, I am getting full, but I did go back and get me some shrimp paste. And um, sorry, I had to put my hair up. I was sweating and then I was eating something spicy and it went down the wrong hole and I almost died and I didn't have enough water. So yeah, y'all almost, I'm glad I didn't film it because it was really bad. I was like crying and I was like, could you bring me some more water? I'm dying. But uh, yeah, so. That's what I got so far. That's a big shrimp paste. And then I got me some more octopus and I got me some more beef and I got me some more enoki mushrooms. So yeah, I'm gonna finish this up and I will get back with y'all in a little while. All right, you guys, I am done. I am full, I am satisfied. Hot Pot 818 Heat was great. The customer service was awesome. Um, the food was seasoned really good. Um, it was a good atmosphere. It did not get packed. I'm surprised because we're literally near International Drive. I thought this place was going to be like trashed. I mean, I, and it's a Saturday night, but I really got lucky. Um, I will put the address down below. Um, they had, like I said, 4.4 uh, five stars on Yelp and Google. Um, everything was great and I absolutely love that people were seeing me vlog, um, you know, uh, me eating and they came up to me like, hey, can I follow you on YouTube or TikTok? I'm like, sure. You know, I'm trying to get that $500, not $500, 500 subscribers so I can, you know, get monetized. So yeah, if you have not liked and shared the video please do so tell your friends and family to like my channel it would be greatly appreciated now I am so full I'm ready to head back to the hotel and um, yeah I'll like I said I'll put the address down below in the descriptions if you have any other questions just let me know at least give me a thumbs up if you watch it even if you don't watch it all just give me a thumbs up, but I hope you watch it all so you can hear me talk. But anyways, I am going to leave the channel. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you have not been to my channel, welcome. My name is Beachy Bunny, and I will see you on the next adventure.